There he is. There's Prince. Prince Wilbur. King Weezer. There's King Weezer. Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome to the channel. We are on the road again in our Leisure Travel Van RV. First stop is Jackson, Mississippi. And then on to Biloxi, Mississippi. And then I think our last uh, part of the trip will be New Orleans. All right. Hey guys, we are in Monroe, Louisiana at um, Flying Hearts Brewing and Pub. I got a Greek salad and Belle got some wings. Oh yeah. Yum. So, the food was really good. We had wings and salad. What would you think about the food? So the wings fell off the bone. I never had wings that just fell off the bone. They were oven roasted wings. They were called canned bacon. So it has some Asian sauce on it with bacon crumbles on the wings itself. The meat just fell off the bones. I, I, I swear I've never had wings like that ever. I mean, I've ate a lot of wings, believe me. <laughs> they were really good. And the Greek salad went really well with them. So yeah. good to stop. Silver Rights Museum here in Mississippi. Very important museum here in Jackson, Mississippi. Um, looks like it's about two hours to walk through, $15 per person. I have to go Mississippi Freedom Struggle. I kind of want to go to this Natchez uh, city here in Mississippi. That's where the old plantations, homes are on the uh, Mississippi River. Here we have the 13th Amendment, outlaw slavery, the 14th Amendment, citizens of African Americans, 15th Amendment prohibits the denial of citizens the right to vote, and then the 19th Amendment right to vote for women. So can the Constitution change? Can the U.S. Constitution be changed? I would say false. Turn it. It is false. It cannot be changed. Uh -oh. The Mississippi state flag from 1861 to Chicago boy 
did the talking. And then he seized Tell and take him away. Three days later, a boy fishing in the Tallahatchie River discovers a bloated corpse protruding from the water. The naked body is weighed down by a cotton gin fan tied around his neck. His face has been savagely beaten. The Freedom Riders. That's like 1950s. That just doesn't seem that long ago, even though it yeah. was. Pretty good museum. Sad, but part of reality. American history. Yeah, it happened. Wilbur, are you enjoying the ride? <laughs> Wilbur's enjoying the ride. We got Weezer down here. Scott. Got out of uh, Jackson, Mississippi. The museum was amazing. It uh, was. I highly recommend that. Uh, yeah, so we're on the road, headed south. Where are we going? We're headed to Biloxi, Mississippi. And we're going to stay at Cajun RV Park. So we'll be there a few nights and never been to Biloxi. So, so I guess it's known for its white sands sand beaches and we're going to be like right across the street from it yeah i don't know um like I, like she said the first time so we'll, we're checking it out we're bringing you along stay tuned sounds good Ocean Springs, Mississippi. It is very cute, but might have to shop before we get there. We'll see. I got him in the store. <laughs> it's a golf cart town here. All these golf carts. You'll see them over here in the front. Huh. <laughs> All right, let's check it out, knucklehead. I know. I am a knucklehead. Reminds me of my dad. He's he calls a lot of people knuckleheads. <laughs> little bit of a tight squeeze in here it's a lot of people out too there's a lot of people hanging out <laughs> I think this is gonna be like a party RV park I think this is kind of our age there's a uh, yeah everybody's looking at us too I know we're pulling in <laughs> late yeah, like it's like 640 so let's go down to the to the uh, boardwalk and Bluxy and check it out. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> we got it's our a bikes out. Cloudy. Got our bikes out. Gonna just ride the beach and check out Bluxy.
How's it going back there? So I like this area. You got the Super 8 next door. If we have visitors, they can stay there. <laughs> Convenience store in the beach right across the street. It's a very good location. The Cajun RV Park. cleaned up right Woody's right next to the uh, RV park. We're gonna have the uh, what, tower? The crab cake tower. Okay, let's see what it is. Yeah. Hey. There's a the crab cake, check that out. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's good. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, that is a good lunch right there. Now we're gonna catch the Uber ride down to... Uh, Golden Nugget? Golden Nugget Casino here in Plexi. How did we do at the Golden Nugget? Well, I'm down $50. We were not winners. <laughs> <laughs> so I guess now we're going to go to... Harrow's Casino. See if our luck changes. Yeah, hey, you put it all on black. <laughs> we are wrapping up our stay here at Cajun RV Park in Blexi. Yeah. It I like this park a lot, especially the convenience close to the water and beaches and restaurants and stuff, but it's pretty tight quarters. Um, we almost ha saw somebody hit our RV while they were pulling in. So it's very tight. <laughs> while they were backing up, they almost backed into us. I, I think they came within less than six inches. Inches, yeah, it was scary. And thankfully we were there to see it um, <laughs> and try to stop it. So next place, so I think we're gonna head to New Orleans for a few days. Um, but definitely like the park. Uh, I would recommend doing like the pull through. I think it costs a little more, but I feel like you get a little bit better um, spot and a little bit more room. Yeah, here's the pull throughs over here. But their dog park was really nice. I really uh, like that. I think Weezer and Wilbur enjoyed it. Um, they maintained it pretty well. So we learned that there's like 30 plus Waffle Houses in this area and they're very popular. Um, Interesting fact is now everything has to be built on stilts uh, due to the hurricane, the last hurricane that wiped the town out. The flood level. Yeah, the flood level. Um, so the ones that are on the ground survived, but the ones that are on stilts are new. And there is a couple of new ones around here. Oh look, there's a lighthouse over there on the left.
we're going to stop by this brewery for lunch. What's it called? Uh, Chandler Island Brewery. Okay. See how the food is, see how the beer is. And hopefully good air conditioning because it's hot and humid. Yeah. Need some refreshments. I mean, it is 11 o'clock in the morning, but it's 5 o'clock somewhere. It's 11.30. <laughs> All of it a little bit. Okay. Okay. You got them situated? I do have them situated. You know, right. at the door. Got the nice air conditioned running for them. So this is what it is inside. What do you think? Pretty cool. It is pretty cool. It's a nice little stop right here off of Highway 90. Yep. Again? A Korean Sammy spicy hand breaded cauliflower or chicken on a sesame seed. That's well, pretty yummy. That sounds pretty good. Yeah. There's some fried okra on the, like the whole okras. Mm. Looks good. Mm. That's good? Mm -hmm. That ranch is good. It has like dill in it. Oh, it has what in it? Dill. Dill? <laughs> So we're gonna have the cauliflower, uh, like a Korean cauliflower sandwich, or sammy with mm. some tots. They split it, so let's see how it is. So Fish, bon Fish Bone Alley is a attraction to do here in um, Gulfport when I was looking up what to do. Looks like they have some aquariums as well. Uh, I don't think we'll do it on this trip though. So there's Fishbone Alley. I read that it's an attraction. I'm not sure why, but it looks like they have some art down there. Here in Gulfport. I heard about that Ship Island Ferry, I think. It takes you to an island that's supposed to be pretty if that's the one that somebody was telling me about, one of the locals. St. Tammany Parish. This place is secured. It's like Fort Knox. It is. That's good though. Okay. All right, we finally made it inside the walls. <laughs> French Quarters <laughs> RV Park. Lots of people coming in. We're right here by the highway. We're gonna see how noisy that is. Yeah, that swing looks kind of cool. Maybe we'll meet some new friends next to us. <laughs> yeah. I don't see any fire pits. So I don't think you need a fire pit here in New Orleans. It's kind of hot. So let's go check out the pool and... Maybe their bathrooms. Do they have laundry here? Maybe. I might need to do some laundry. Yeah, so this location is right next to the French Quarter. So we'll see how far that is. If it's walking distance or we have to catch an Uber. Maybe during the day we can walk it. Nighttime, I don't know. A little shady. It is a little shady. Okay. Well, watch your pockets. Just be mindful. There's the laundry. Open it up. Let's check it out. Oh, nice. Nice laundry uh, facilities. It's like $3.25. And that's $2.50. 
different sizes maybe. Oh, okay. So the small Our dryer. Oh, these are dryers. Yeah. Okay. Makes sense. Credit only. Credit card only. There's the restroom and the shower. Not bad. It's a pretty nice pool. What do you think? Yeah. Check this out. It's what a fitness it? center. Oh. You oh. wanted to try to hit the gym while we were gone. Okay. Ah, there I am. Got some weights? Yeah. While I'm working, you can uh, come do some exercising. The complimentary ice. Oh, nice and cold too. We can use that. Oh, nice. Get a Ziploc bag full of ice yeah. instead of having to make our own. <laughs> yeah. The RV park tour. Yeah, so we're unhooked. It took us like five minutes to, or, to get everything hooked up. Now, what do we do? I don't know. What do we do? <laughs> it's a Sunday. Memorial weekend. We've been told, are reminded to be careful if we go down to town, downtown in the quarters. Yeah. Let's see what this voodoo museum is about. Okay. Stop looking at that. <laughs> wow. Alright, we're here at Oceana's off of Bourbon Street, New Orleans. We got the corn dip, the Cajun corn dip. So Oceana is a restaurant famous for the for the kitchen nightmares, but you won't be able to find it on there because of legal litigations. So. It's the taster. So Taste of New Orleans. Taste of New Orleans. Yep. That's good stuff. There's a line back there. Yeah. Long line. Yeah, it does. <laughs> Need a hangover cure?
some okra gumbo with sausage, chicken, and shrimp. Oh, nice. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. And that line is long too. Very popular place. We're at the famous Mother's Restaurant. It's New Orleans cuisine. Some famous people have come here, filmed here. Um, I got the po' boy. Where did you get it? I got a bunch of vegetables. They didn't have a vegetable plate, but I got all kinds of veggies. Cabbage, turnip greens, red beans and rice, and some green beans with tomatoes. Yeah. So there's a line out the door, so get here early or just be prepared to wait a little while. Hi. Oh man, look at that. Got potato salad. Got oh, all your man. veggies. I am loving this. Yeah. I love Or just got out of New Orleans. New Orleans is a lot to take in. It's, it hasn't changed in 40 years. I mean, it's just bar boom, and everybody's competing against who has the loudest music and rap music and, and cars that go boom, boom, you know, down Bourbon Street and stuff like that. It hasn't changed. There's a lot to take in if you're not used to that. So, it was a good two nights there. Glad to be on our way. Go to Shreveport and then back home. in Shreveport, Louisiana in the parking lot of Margaritaville. Boon docked last night. Nice place. I slept really good here in the parking lot. Yeah guys, so I made a sports bet in the sports book. They have a sports book grill. We had pizza there. Huge TVs everywhere. Watch the uh, hockey game. Uh, that's about it. Still on our way home. We got another, what about four hours three ago? Or three or four. four hours ago. The fun part is going to find a dump station because my app that I use is no longer working. So we'll see. 